Trust me when I tell you that hard work pays in life. And in this life journey, don't give up. Keep pushing. You are welcome to Aboki Music TV. Today, we're going to be having a chat with someone who started from grass to grace. A businessman, an entrepreneur, and a hustler. Olamide Godwin, aka Ola Might. I am Nuno Wisdom. You can call me Smasher. Stay with us as you get inspired. My name is Godwin Alamide Adechube uh, from Ondo State, Aboko South East Local Government. I was born and brought up in Jalingo, Taraba State. Uh, a bit about myself, um, I am a go-getter, a very humble personality. I, um, I schooled in uh, Saraba State University, Economics Department, and um, I lived uh, most of my life in Jalingo here before moving for service in Ibadan. So, uh, Allah Mighty as a person, I'm a crypto trader. I started um, my, my career though as a salary earner, work with Eta Nigeria. Uh, for a few months before I ventured into cryptocurrency full time and uh, from there I was able to expand on my, my business down to uh, real estate and uh, also affiliate marketing and what have you. As you all know, uh, it's never easy at the start. Um, uh, I think that was back uh, 2017 uh, when I was about to go for NYC. I told myself that uh, I'm not going to come back here uh, doing nothing, you know. I told myself this is just a stepping stone for me to start my life, my hustle, and to pursue my career. So I left uh, Jalingo to serve. That is where the hustling started. Because back then, my father and mother paid my bill, but after then, with the help of a few friends, I was able to, to learn cryptocurrency and uh, uh, was able to venture into it. But then, you need money to, to do any business, and that is where the challenges come from. Nobody is ready to, you know, nobody is ready to help, nobody is ready to, you know. People can, can teach you something, but when it comes to taking their own money, to you know, invest in you or give it to you, it becomes a difficult part. So I have to start running around. Man, it was a whole lot of you know uh, stress. But then God came through, and uh, I was able to start. And uh, then and then business keep growing. And uh, yeah, my today. Sticky on the beat, you know. So many things I wanna talk about. Next one. mighty comprises of a lot of things. However, we started from uh, investment. We take money from people while we give them percentage on uh, their capital uh, as a return uh, of whatsoever they have uh, invest to the company. Uh, but now we have a stand, we build for people, we will buy and we sell land. So in general terms, let's say we are into real estate now. In the pardon. However, we are looking into expanding the business down to Jalingo. So, Agu Mighty now presently we focus more on real estate. We buy and sell land, we build for people, we also build to sell. And we have few properties on ground for sell, though uh, presently we have in the pardon and uh, Lagos State. Uh, but we are looking at uh, bringing some down to Jalingo. Agu Mighty uh, came from Allah Mighty. Then how did I come about Allah Mighty? When I was in school, 
my love for big, big things. You know, when, when you're talking about things, I just want the bigger one. So people start say, saying mighty, mighty. So I now said, okay, fine. Ola Mide, let me just uh, remove the Mide, then put Ola Mighty. So that is how I come about the nickname Ola Mighty, right from school time. So now that I want to start the company, and I said, fine, I still want to maintain the mighty uh, Adi Jube, Godwin, Ola Mide. So the A is, you know, the, the first alphabet, A from Adi Jube, G from Godwin, then O from Ola Mide, that is Ago Mighty. Just like I said before, we want to expand the business down to Jalingo. So in the next five years, uh, I see my company being one of the best in Jalingo, uh, Taraba State, uh, where we have our own estate and the largest in the Taraba State. We hope to benefit uh, Tarabians uh, in job creation. Uh, if you don't have the complete money, we can make part payment or uh, half payment before you make uh, the completion of the money. So that's where we see uh, Agro Mighty in the next five years. I have done that in the past and I'm still doing that. Uh, you know, uh, the, the joy of every every boss or the joy of every person that has, has attained some level in life is who and who has it helped. That is to me, you know, because it comes to a time in life where you fall back to these people, whether you like it or not. You understand? So presently, I can mention some few names, but just because of, uh, you know, let me keep that aside. I have, yeah, I have good numbers of people I have helped, and they are doing very, very well. Some in Abuja, some in Lagos, some in Ibadi. And I still have more that are still, you know, I'm still grooming. Generally, the advice normally comes like this, don't give up, be focused, be motivated, and uh, always uh, be good at what you do. Uh, but for me, I would advise you to allow yourself to be used. Well, you might not understand uh, this statement I just made. You know, a lot of people feel like uh, people are using them, people, you can't get to where you're going to without being used. And if you are used, it means you are useful to yourself. Because you cannot be useful to another person if you are not useful to yourself. So allow yourself to be used. That is the process. Tomorrow, you also will use another person. That is life for you. Before you get to where you are going to, somebody needs to use you. But believe me, one day, you will get to a stage where you would be the boss of yourself. So when people feel like, ah, he's using me, I can't continue with him, I can't continue with this, they are using me, you won't get to where you're going to. Yeah.